Okay, okay, it's your buddy Mike Messier. We have a very special return of what's in the bag. Now we know it's from Pro Wrestling Tees. This is one hour tees, but it's uh, it's Pro Wrestling Tees in my case. So we're, we're gonna see, we'll make this quick, folks. I know we all have busy days, but what I understand, my good friends in the Northeast, New England, Rhode Island, so forth, are suffering through snow. And I'm not. I'm here. It's it's a little windy, but I can deal with a little wind. I'm a man. And uh, I'm going to open up this video. Okay, so I know he likes to get the bag open. So what do we have here? It looks very nice. It looks very uh, professional. Oh my. There you see Monty, and there you see the Pharaoh, Michael Monty, Jimmy Pharaoh. Let's see. Hold, hold right there. I'll see what I can do, folks. I'm out in public. They're congratulating me on this shirt. They're very excited for me. This shirt. Everyone's excited. Everyone's very enthusiastic. folks pull the little magic act it's a nice shirt I'm glad I got the uh, tan color I got that knowing that summer will be here in Florida before you know it uh, which is the one Florida I'm in AEW territory and I just say that because I am literally in Jacksonville Florida where I live I was here first by the way um, I understand that Jim Ross lives in this area. Uh, he and I have yet to set up a lunch date to discuss the business. And uh, what else? I know that Connie, as he calls him, is very excited. There's a bonus shirt here, folks, because what I did with this pro wrestling tease is that when you, when you check out, I'm always a sucker for the, hey, don't go, get one more thing. So I got a bonus shirt. And that would be this, uh, I'm not sure what the fuck it is, to be honest. It looks like, I mean, today's, it's another, <laughs> I have a feeling, no offense, but that's another John Moxley shirt. And that's like the second time that a bonus shirt has been a John Moxley shirt. So, no offense, I just don't know if his shirts are selling, to be honest with you, Moxley. I like Moxley. But I mean, I, I, it might be one of those deals where they thought because he had all that WWE exposure, he was going to come in and set the world on fire. But anyway, let's go back to this nice shirt. It's a nice shirt. Monty and the Pharaoh show has hosted me three or four times. And, uh, you know, as far as my own podcasting, wrestling, podcasting, wrestling rants, I'm kind of just concentrating my own thing, folks, to be honest with you. I mean, I, I still love pro wrestling, but... I love pro wrestling in like 1983. This ghost of pro wrestling, I, I still do watch it, and I, I'm glad that wrestling exists, and I think that there's a certain aura and a mystique of a ring, four sides, three ropes, an arena, a referee, a contest, a storyline, but you know, these guys can figure out how to make it more entertaining, I'll be more enthusiastic. And, you know, they should have hired me 12, 13 years ago. We all know that. So, Mike Messier with your What's in the Bag, the Monty and the Pharaoh show. Uh, please watch and listen. They have great guests, Bruce Beefcake, 
the late great Road Warrior Animal was on there with uh, uh, that was a great show. Uh, who else has been on? Evan uh, Ginsburg, he has a show up there too. But on the Monty and the Pharaoh show, uh, they've had so many wonderful people. Um, trying to, the Road Warrior Animal episode sticks out because I, I watched that one not too long before he passed away. Uh, they had Tony Atlas, and they were going to have that, you know, Rocky Johnson, Tony Atlas reunion. Unfortunately, Rocky passed away. So it's it's sad when all these great wrestlers go go away from us. But they're in the big ring in the sky, and and uh, that's all you can ask for. So Monty and the Pharaoh show. Uh, keep doing great episodes. And uh, I believe you had Barry Windham, one of my favorites. I saw him beat the Great Muda for the NWA World Title in uh, Asheville, North Carolina. MikeMessier.com, Mike Messier YouTube channel.